Hey everyone, it's Lexi, aka The Gluten Free Gal. Last week I did a brand versus brand gluten free cracker edition because I love snacking during the summertime. Well, we are going to continue the snacking with a brand review of pretzels. Pretzels are another great snack that go along with that cheese, meat, and fruit combo that I talked about, so it seemed fitting to try them out today. I recently had a brand reach out to me about trying their gluten free pretzels, so I'm trying them for the very first time with you guys today. The brand is called Savor by Susie. I already love this brand because they have so many different flavors of pretzels. We have the regular sea salt, roasted garlic and herb, which I'm really excited to try, a little bit spicy, dark chocolate covered pretzels, and milk chocolate covered pretzels. The only gluten free pretzel brand I have previously tried is the Snyder's brand, and they're pretty good. I would give them like a 7 out of 10. But I'm excited to see if I like this brand more because I'm always looking for a great summertime snack. If you look closely at the packaging, each of their flavors are certified gluten-free, vegan, and nut-free. And on the back, they support autism awareness, and as a previous SPED teacher, I love that. So let's get started. We're just going to ease into it by starting with the sea salt flavor. I am obsessed with the flavoring of this. I do wish it had more salt on it, but it has this like buttery flavor that would taste so good with anything or even on its own. It also had a great crunch that wasn't too hard, but just enough. So definitely a great start. I am not a huge fan of spicy, so I'm a little nervous for this one, but it says a little bit, so hopefully there is only a little spice to it. Surprisingly, it wasn't too spicy. I was able to handle it, but it really didn't do much for me. I would prefer the sea salt over this, but if you like a little bit of spice, then you might really enjoy these ones. I'm really excited for this one. I love a good garlic flavor, so we will see if it does have that roasted garlic and herb taste to it. Out of all the three savory flavors, this one is definitely my favorite. It wasn't too overwhelming in its flavor, which I really like, but just enough to kind of make it fun and interesting. Now we're on to the sweet flavors. I'm going to start off with the dark chocolate one. I was really not a fan of this one, but that's only because of personal preference. I don't really care for dark chocolate, but if you do, you will love these. It has so much chocolate on them. I think these are going to be a hit for me. This is the milk chocolate flavor. Yep, these ones definitely beat out all the rest. There's just something about that perfect sweet and salty mix. There's a lot of chocolate on these and you can really taste the saltiness from the pretzels and it was just perfection. So I would say out of all the different flavors, my rankings would be first the milk chocolate covered pretzels, then the garlic and herb, sea salt, a little bit spicy, and then the dark chocolate. Again, all of those were just kind of based on my personal preference. Overall though, I really love this brand. I would say that it's better than the Snyder's brand. I would give this brand as a whole an 8 out of 10. If you look on the back, it says that they are free from grain, gluten, peanut, tree nut, soy, dairy, egg, sesame. They're vegan, paleo, and kosher. Normally when you take all of those away from a food, they have no taste to them, but all of these are really delicious. And again, I just really support what this brand stands for. They have their story on the back, which is really interesting, so I would definitely say check them out. Definitely think that they make enough flavors to fit everyone's needs. I'll make sure to put a link below so you can check out their pretzels. If you want even more gluten-free content, make sure to go follow me on Instagram and TikTok. You can find me at ls.glutenfreegal. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on a video every Monday.